Welcome back. I am your host Narendkar. I come to you tonight with a very good news that the truth of the fake charges against Republic TV has been made public. It has proved that the fake allegations leveled against Republic TV were absolutely false. The Enforcement Directorate in its provisional attachment order in the fake TRP case has mentioned 50 times the name of India today uh, in the fake TRP case which was mentioned in the original FIR which Parambir Singh in his press conference in Mumbai had not revealed. The ED did not mention even once in its report the name of uh, Republic TV. So no money was paid by Republic TV to boost its TRP in a very illegal of fashion or unethical fashion unlike India today which indulged in these activities. So this is a huge vindication for Republic TV and Arnab Goswami who is the editor-in-chief of the channel. The most astonishing thing is that India today has not reported this very fact, this very news, this very provisional order of the ED in any of their shows. That's quite shameful and decency requires that these shameless Lutians media and its associates should come out and acknowledge that they had spread lies or uh, leveled fake allegations against Republic TV and Arnab Goswami. They had attacked Republic TV, its colleagues, friends, advertisers and investors by hurling lies at them. Yet Republic TV stands vindicated and undefeated. People, you must launch a tirade on India Today and some other channels which, which, which have been found guilty of spreading lies to destroy Republic TV. People don't keep everything on the shoulders of the government. It is your it is your duty to take up some of the issues on, on your own and launch an attack on such TV channels which are not only anti-India but also anti-Hindu. So you must understand that more than the government nation comes first and government has limitations they have to work within the framework of the laws of the country they cannot go hammer and tongs against such bloody Lutian media media people who spread lies the onus also lies on us the nationalists to take up the matter and name and shame them wherever you find even if you come across them at public events like seminars or any other uh, conferences they should be named and shamed repeatedly on their faces in public let us see how, uh, let us see 
thereafter whether they reform themselves. Friends, if you like this uh, video, please like it and share it and please subscribe the channel and also if you wish to contribute, I have given uh, the platforms from where you can contribute so that you can make me stand up to these lie perpetrators and I shall be and make me successful in doing it with great uh, with great strength. So friends, Jai Hind, Vande Matra.